This is Dabu7. Let's take a look here at the hospitals and what they're saying that they're doing in response to this whole thing across the country. As we continue to see things shut down, not only in this country, but in other countries across the board, we now have circus-like tents being set up in the parking lots of hospitals to help deal with this. Same thing that we were witnessing in other places. It's now happening here. And just like we were witnessing in Italy, where they were calling doctors out of retirement. The U.S. doing the same. Guarding their supplies of face masks and making plans to cancel elective surgery because they're saying that they may be forced to ration medical care. This is from Fox 11 Los Angeles stating this, saying that this is what they're all preparing for at this moment in time. What this is going to cause is a conundrum in some of these places because they're saying some of the people may be forced to stay or share rooms with others that are infected. You're not going to have no friends or family around you at that point unless they too are deemed infected and they're going to be in a lockdown with those people. But they're saying that this could hamper things in terms of other people that are injured coming in for other emergencies and everything else. You know, once one one hospital is listed as taking people in and treating this, a lot of the nurses, doctors, everyone's going to be on heightened alert, but it raises the chance, no doubt, that even if they're setting up tents outside, if people are going to and from inside the hospital, out to these tents, back and forth, that it gets inside the hospital somehow. People are just going to have to stay on top of, of things the best that they can here. In this instance, though, calling people out of retirement is exactly what Italy did, and you saw what happened in Italy afterwards. They started to lock places down right after they closed the schools and certain businesses, which is where we are at right now. So Iran in full-blown lockdown. Spain announcing that they're going to be going into full-blown lockdown as well. So I'll have more updates over on the next live stream, over here exclusively on DLive. You'll find links in the description box below. Much love.